Hi, my name is Eric Tenner, and I wrote the book, The Amazing Dog Training Man. I wrote this a couple of years ago, and the reason I wrote the book was to help dog owners understand their dogs better, understand the training process a lot better, because when it comes to dogs and dog training, there's a lot of information out there, and it can be very confusing for a dog owner. You know, um, this person says, do this. This person says, no, don't do that, do this. And then your vet says, no, you should never do any of that stuff. You should be doing this. And you go talk to a dog trainer, and everybody's giving you all this information. The other problem is that there's a lot of myths out there about dogs. And in my book, I wrote about the five biggest myths. And I want to talk about myth number four. And this is a biggie. This really should be myth number one. Because it is wait until your dog is six months old to start training. Any of you guys ever heard that advice? Oh, don't train the dog until he's six months old. Um, I just finished reading the book, Marley and Me. Great book. Fantastic book. And um, the advice they got from their friends and everybody else was, no, 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 don't. Wait till the dog is six months old. Let him be a puppy. Bad, bad, bad advice. <laughs> it was terrible advice. And if you've ever heard that, wait till six months. Don't listen to that person. Start training your puppy immediately. Start at eight weeks old. Start to socialize your puppy. Start to teach them. They can learn simple commands. Sit down, uh, come, stay. They can all start learning this at eight weeks old, believe it or not. And what happens is that the little brain starts working. And it's going to make it much easier to train them later on. Could you imagine if you had a kid and you said, oh, well, we're going to let him uh, be a kid. And we're going to wait till he's 13 years old before we start teaching him anything. That child would be at a huge disadvantage because all that time had gone by. Think about a, a dog, you know. Those first, um, first couple of months of his life, very impressionable, and you really can teach your dog a lot. You can teach him how to do all these commands. But even more importantly, your dog needs the socialization. Socialization is key for a young puppy. They need to experience other dogs, different people, different situations, different sights, different sounds, different smells. The more you socialize the dog, the more they're going to be, the more stable they're going to be as an adult dog. The dogs that really suffer in life are the dogs that are sheltered for the first six months to a year of their lives. The dogs that don't get any training. The dogs that are um, kept away from everybody because those dogs don't turn into stable dogs because there's what's called critical periods that your puppy goes through, and if they don't get exposed, if they don't socialize properly during these critical periods, it's really going to affect the dog as an adult dog. So. Don't listen to the advice about waiting to train till six months old. Start at eight weeks old. I cover a lot of that in this book, but there's also a lot of other good resources that you can use. Um, if you're looking for a trainer in your area, I highly encourage you to check out APDT.com. You can enter your zip code and you can find a trainer in your area. Uh, that's the Association of Pet Dog Trainers. Phenomenal organization. They can help you out a lot. And again, if uh, you want the right place to start, just check out the book, Amazing Dog Training Man. Thanks for watching this video. Good luck with your...